and welcome back to Into the Pit. If you like my channel, hit that like button and follow and subscribe for more interviews and reviews coming up. Today we're going to go back to old school death metal. Um, not exactly to Tampa, Florida, we're going to go to Canada and um, talk a little bit about the band Gorguts. This is their debut and I actually first heard of Gorguts on the uh, Monsters of Death compilation uh, that was brought out by Rock Hard magazine here in Germany and the song considered that immediately had me you know it was that typical Tampa Florida Morris sound Scott Burns sound but man I was so into that and I still enjoy this album a lot the follow-up Erosion of Sanity is also a great album after that they lost me they just went totally technical and I just couldn't get into it but this is a classic uh, along with the Classic Dan Seagrave cover, obviously. Wow, I think it's, this is one of his best. And, um, you know, this actually came out in, it's funny how they never put dates on here. Uh, 91, yeah. So, death metal scene booming right there. Great tracks on here Stiff and Cold, Disincarnated, the, the title track, Considered Dead, Rot Anatomy, um, Bodily Corrupted, Drifting Remains, Inoculated Life. Yeah, this is. Excellently done um, death metal, obviously quite heavily influenced by Chuck Schuldiner's death, but I mean um, So many bands out there did exactly that. I mean um, death was sort of um, a pioneer and I think a lot of bands went in that direction I mean and then later on moved on and, and sort of honed their sound down to become more either more technical or or leave the death metal genre altogether so <clears throat> but this was definitely um, Death Worship, and um, as with the follow-up, Erosion of Sanity. Unfortunately, I don't have that on LP. Damn, <clears throat> been trying to get all of it. No luck. Or, well, I wasn't prepared to pay the prices that I saw on eBay, so. But yeah, excellent piece of work here. Um, no, I've got a lyric sheet. This is still the classic sort of Roadrunner records layout. I mean, Roadrunner were just picking up these bands left, right, and center, really, at that time, so. So, if you like your death metal more straight, in your face, meat and potatoes, um, well, meat and potatoes is probably not correct. Uh, they, there is technical proficiency on this record, definitely, you can hear it. And um, so it kind of makes sense, or you would expect them to go more technical in the following albums. I mean, even the Erosion of Sanity is slightly more technical than this album, so. Anyway, if you... Uh, <clears throat> missed out on this one in the death metal, the early death metal boom, then wow, try and get your hands on it. Quite pricey getting these on vinyl these days, but I mean, there are those CD packages where the first two um, come out in one package, so you can also go for those. They did those for Exorder, um, various other bands, King Diamond, I believe. Yeah, so quite a few. Malevolent Creation. So, yes. And once again, <clears throat> wonderful artwork by the mighty Mr. Seagrave. So there you go. Gorguts, consider dead. Check it out. <laughs> 